Rebs got kidnapped? Wow, I missed a lot. Yeah, that's a long story, but yeah. <laughs> Rebecca and Panda both got kidnapped, and then I went after him. And, uh, and I couldn't save him. <laughs> Unfortunately. <laughs> I did my best. Guys, I'm gonna push so that on stream today, hopefully, we can get, like, a bunch of new colonists. Hopefully three at least. Maybe more. Aaron's super close. Orange is close. Uh, I think if I... We might try this... This crypto sleep casket once we have, uh... Once we have some more room. Meteor, compacted machinery. That's actually super clutch. Here we go. Oh, the gatherer is fully healed. Great, Vol. Why are you so stressed, Vol? My friend Cockroach died? Oh, good. Love that. Love that so much. <clears throat> friend cockroach, you know. Just just your normal normal friend, cockroach. Normal name for a friend, cockroach. Yep. Sure. 100%. I think we might let Linux become our main cook. Linux, do you want to become our main cook? Mars is now no longer going to cook at such the same rate. We have we have to do it, honestly. Uh, okay, so that means we have to refigure these. The cook simple meals is now Linux first. Or any worker first. Uh, let's actually make it Mar or Linux, and then Linux. Okay. We have a new recruit. Let's go. New recruit. Let's go. All right. So if you're in the chat, go ahead and type. Um, if you have not been a character yet. Um, Panda and Lost have both been characters yet. Lost, if you would like to join the queue to have a second character named after you, by the way, just type, just type, uh, type join and we would be happy to add you. Otherwise, this looks like this is actually going to be Cool Guy. Um, who I don't think we have, we haven't had a Cool Guy yet, right? No, we have not. Wait, a mad wild boar? Ah, piss. Are all of them mad or just the one? Run! Oh, you killed it. Damn. Alright, never mind. I love it, Lost. I love it. Alright, cool. So we have a new character. Heron, welcome to the colony. Uh, let's get to know you here in a second. But first, here's the deal. Wear, uh, wear quality stuff. Don't be a cannibal. And don't do drugs. That's the only rules we have here. Otherwise, we're going to name you... Cool guy. And we're going to get to know you. Cool guy is, it turns out, uh, a muffalo shaman. Love that. Incapable of violence. They are psychically sensitive. He is psychically sensitive. Teetotaler and tough. Those are actually decent. Uh, animal skill of four. Cooking skill of six. Mm, none of this is great. None of this is great. Uh, we're going to make... Cool guy, I, lo I love you. I'm sorry. We're going to make you be a hauler, number one priority. And a cleaner, number two priority. And other than that, you're basically not going to do anything. Other than that, you'll do mining. Um, and that's it. And plant cutting when it's time to cook. Or when it's time to, to cut. Let's do it. Hey, F4, how's it going? Law says, if my name is never used, can you name the rocket after me? That's a great question. I don't think I can name the rocket. 
But I can, I can pretend. Sure. <laughs> Good thanks in you. I'm having an okay day. Okay day. Yeah. Thanks for asking. Or, you know, name a table after me. All right. Deal. Yep. Table's great. <laughs> Yeah, I can name a table after you. <laughs> oh, what an idea. This is our colony. These are our colonists. And this is the table named after Lost. Surprise is in a sad wander. Surprise, what's going on, my guy? It happened because of poor mood. Well, that happens sometimes. Sorry to hear that surprise. Quest expired, that's fine. What are you up to today, uh, F4? Are you at work? Or, uh, are you at school? Just announced to everyone this mighty Lost is about to launch or something like that. Oh, yeah. Our rocket named Launch. I'm trying to think the worst thing you could name. Oh, my God. We have a, rhinos a rhinoceros. We name a We have a rhinoceros. Name a chair after me so that maybe someone would finally sit on my face. <laughs> Yo, that's brilliant. That's brilliant. Guys, we have a rhinoceros. What are we going to call our rhin our rhinoceros? Also, Panda the goat is uh is pregnant again. What are we going to name our rhinoceros? Of course, says I'm on break. Call it Ryan. Ryan the rhinoceros. Deal? It's easy. Very easy. F4 is on break. School going okay today? Ryan Osiris? I kind of like that better, actually. Ryan Osiris? <laughs> F4 says I have so much homework. Exclamation, 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 exclamation. Oh, no. That's four exclamation points. That's a lot of exclamation points, my friend. F4, I don't know if I said this, but if you would like a character in this game named after you, all you have to do is type exclamation join, by the way. Mars is finally doing research. Let's go. I have to do crypto sleep caskets. We'll go from there. All right, defense. The defenses are mostly about launching the ship. <clears throat> All right, guys, it's finally time. And by time, I mean we can start thinking about it being time. Escaping from this planet, it would be freedom at last and maybe a return home, but also incredibly dangerous. Many desperate souls want off this planet. Ship reactors take 15 days to charge up. Once you begin that process, the ship reactor will emit an energy signature detectable from thousands of kilometers away. Raiders will flock to attack you in waves with an intensity you've never seen. Mechanoids are also known to be attracted to such energy signatures for their own mysterious reasons. It won't start until you activate your ship's reactor, but when it does, it'll be ferocious. You'll need to stockpile resources, weapons, and defenses for the onslaught if you hope to escape alive. There we are. That's what I was saying earlier. Um, we're, to, we're to the stage where... We're to the stage where... We could start building stuff for the ship um so it's gonna that's gonna take some uh it's gonna take some wait where's the deep drilling do i already have deep drilling yeah i do right there okay great uh it's gonna take some work but we can do it it's gonna be a long it's gonna be a long goddamn time before we uh before we get quite there but Linux, go ahead and trade with this uh, thing. Okay, we could buy some monkeys. We could sell some animals. Buy a bunch of components. Probably worth it. Let's see if we can if we can make it happen. Bunch of smoke leaf joints, plasteel. 
What the fuck? That's a lot of plasteel. Uh... Triple rocket launcher. Sell some gold, but we need some gold. We can sell our sculpture. Telescope. Okay, so the question here is what do we need and how and how desperately do we need it? Uh, I'm going to be really honest with you guys. I don't want to ever sell my pets, but like it might be time to sell the pets. Let's buy uh, advanced. We can always make more components is the problem. We should probably just buy like some plasteel. I don't know how much plasteel we need though, you know? Let's just buy it. I don't know how much we need. Hey Nick, how's it going, dude? Hello, hello. Oh no, footnotes in a sad wander. Nick, uh, I have bad news for you. I don't remember if I showed you this already. Uh, but may you may you rest in pieces. Um, Nick, you died. Uh, I'm really sorry about that. I'm, I'm really, really sorry about that. But you did die in the game. Nick says it's going. Abby and I just got to run in. How cold are you right now? Pretty cold out there, right? It was freezing this morning. I think it's gotten a little bit better. It's upsetting that I died. I know. I was upset too. It turns out I was pissed. Uh, you didn't get to live very long either. And I really wish that you had. Um, I'm sorry. I, I did my best, but it just it wasn't happening. Um, buy more plasteel. Wait a second. This is the same shit. So it must be... This one, there it is. It actually wasn't too bad. Welcome to the gang of dead people. <laughs> uh, yikes. There's more of you than I thought there was going to be, actually. Yeah. There's a good chunk of you who are dead. Um. Yeah. It sucks. Sell a bunch of these. Er, great. How are the legs feeling, Nick? How are the uh, how is the how is the run overall? Uh, okay, we could buy a couple things here. Buy a couple things here. We have an assault rifle. That's one thing I didn't do is give the new guy uh, some guns. We buy frag grenades, actually. Howdy doody. Hey, doughy guy. How's it going? How are you? How we doing? Howdy doody. Uh, it was good. Got a little workout in. What was the workout? Nick, I'm stoked. We're thinking about uh, about potentially running together uh, here very soon. Um, for a, uh, a potential race in the in the spring. I'm, I'm stoked about it. Very stoked about it. Got my errands run. Does that count? That, that definitely counts as a run. Yeah, of course. Of course. Uh, cool guy is incapable of violence. I just remembered. That's not good. Let's give one of our better shooters a good gun here. Um, probably not Brack. Electric's got a heavy SMG. Surprises a bolt action. Let's give him an assault rifle. Yeah. One and a half mile warm up. Three mile tempo. One and a half cooldown. Averaged a little under 640. Nice, dude. Nice. Good on you guys. Mars is starving. Mars, you're you're a cook. Just eat. Just eat. Joey, how's life treating you? Good to see you. Oh. We're over here just uh just trying to make new new friends out of the colony. Um we're awfully close on uh, on one of these, on orange. Not so close on the other one. So we're gonna go put ourselves in the uh, in the face of danger. 
by opening up some crypto sleep caskets over here. What does my day on Friday look like? Um, I don't know off the top of my head. What's up? Let me look. Friday, Megan gets the second dose of the vaccine. I think we are dog sitting on... We're dog sitting for her brother on Saturday, I think. Possibly want to run together. I would love that. I would love that. Uh, Dose has just got done watching your new Vegas upload. Nice. Hope you enjoyed it. I actually recorded some more New Vegas yesterday. Um, all right, so these are... Where do I have the new guy sleeping? Cool guy sleeping over here? No, cool guy. There's there's so much better beds over here. Sleep over here, cool guy. I would love that, man. I got work at one, so I'd have to be a morning run. That works. That works perfectly, though. Oh yeah, Dewey. How's that? How do you how do you do it? <clears throat> uh. Okay. Let's see here. More ambrosia. Good. Nick, I love it, dude. Let's uh let's run together Friday. I think I have like eight miles. But I'll go however many you guys want. Uh so long as it's eight or less. <laughs> How, however long you guys are going, I'll go at least at least that far with you and then tack on if I need to. I see, I see, Doey, I see. I see. There's so many quest lines to complete in Fallout New Vegas. I, uh, there's so many things to do. There's not enough time, you know? I got so many things I want to get done. I'm curious about all, all of it. Do I need more sandstone? Is that what's happening here? I do need more sandstone. Mars is researching. Just the way we like. Just the way we like. Getting that research in. Mars is going to work early. Hitting the books. Doing some homework. Very nice. We'll see how much we will do, but it won't be eight. I love it. Nick, I know we're uh, I know we're thinking about this uh, this run, right? In April. Do you think Abby would be down to try and do it too? Is Abby... We have a new recruit. Let's go. Let's go. Type in the chat if you're here and you're already on the list of people who would like to be added to the colony. If you're not, you can type exclamation join and you'll be added to the list. I think this one is likely going to be uh, Affy. We haven't had an Affy yet. We'll see if Abby wants to. That's what I was thinking. I was like, it'd be, it'd be a great chance for her to have a whole bunch of people. Uh, a whole bunch of people help pace her. That's what I was thinking, Nick. I was like, I think it's low 120s-ish, but I don't know how how close. Cool guy's throwing a party? Oh, let's go, cool guy. Let's go. Panda says, fluffle my nyanyas. <laughs> Doey, what all do you have uh, going on today, right? Mars is no longer catatonic. He, that is correct. That is correct. Party is finished. All right. Affable Olive, welcome. AKA Affy, welcome to the... Uh... Welcome to the colony. Affy is an excellent shot. Uh, decent, has a, has a passion for construction, is good with animals, and good with intellectual, incapable of dumb labor. Interesting. I wonder what to do here. I wonder what to do here. She's an undergrounder. Um, and a slow poke. So she walks slow. <laughs> Also sanguine, uh, which means like permanent mood effect of plus 12, which sounds like Affy. Like Affy's just such a positive, positive influence. No health problems. Uh, yeah. Cool. All right, Affy. Welcome to the freaking colony. So he says I sound like a broken record, but I'm going to play some Fallout. I love it. I love it. I love it. Well, at least you got your errands done. F4 says I'm going to try to finish my homework so I can watch stream. Sounds great. Sounds great. Abby's an excellent shot, so let's go ahead and give her a good bolt action rifle. 
you know? Uh, feet. Nope, nope. Take the bolt action. Also, welcome to the colony. Uh, you get, like... You get, uh, you get... You get... Where is it? Where is it? You get to wear, uh, quality... Quanti quality clothing. You can't be a cannibal, and you don't get to do drugs. Our schedule is really, really pretty simple. Um... You get to eat lunch. Other than that, you basically have to work all of the day. You do get an hour before bed to, to do what you want. But. Yeah. Uh, Nick says, yeah, but I don't think I know a better crew to get her to a fast PR. It's true. Even if she had, even if she could just stick on us for a little bit. Chat, me, best man Nick, uh, our friend Eclipso, etc. A couple other people are... Uh, are hoping to you have Affy construct. Are hoping to uh, do a lot of running together this uh, this this spring. Maybe try and do a fast a fast run, fast race, fast half marathon. Uh, what would I prefer that Affy do first? Hunt. I could have Affy sleep in late. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to have Affy sleep in late. Uh, recreate, but then work later as well. Three, four hours. So that most of the day we have a... Uh, somebody doing some, some research, maybe. I don't know. Sure. We'll try it. Who knows? That is most of... I think we may have one more person who would like to have a character named after them the first time around. We've gone through so many people. Nick says, BRB sounds good, man. I'm going to have to look into this game. It looks like the kind of minutia managing that I like. It's very, very micromanagey. Yeah, yeah. Super. Super micromanagey. Um... The better you get at it, the less you have to micromanage. But if you want to, it's always there, you know? It's always a possibility. Yeah, this is an incredible game, Doey. Incredible game. I would recommend it uh, 100 times out of 10. 100 times out of 10. 10 times out of 10. Super good. Super good. Well... Mars is researching his ass off. Oh, I know. I was going to look at... Uh, I was going to look at deep drilling. Deep drill right there. Let's turn this on. And let's have somebody come take a look at it. Um, here's our miner. Mining is about to become more important for us. Prizes are minor. F4 says I suck at it. Rimworld. <laughs> it's it's a hard game for anybody though. Is the deal, you know? That's technically research. What? Mars is going to do it? Okay. When I play Stellaris, I start with one solar system, manage it myself. Then as I grow, I assign governors to manage things for me as I expand things. Okay, I should probably not have him doing this, actually. Uh, I think we're just going to turn that off. Surprise. Go ahead and eat some chocolate, by the way. Insect jelly, actually. Um, I've never played Stellaris. Stellaris. Uh, but everybody talks about it as so, like, uh, like such a deep game. Ryan, have you ever thought about playing The Escapist? The Escapist. The Escapist.
Oh, I have watched this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would love to play this game. Yeah, yeah. I have watched. Uh, I've watched a very small amount of it, but I would really love it. Um, Panda. Yeah. Good idea. I'll write it down. This sounds closer to Sims, where the characters have individual autonomy. Yeah, it's kind of like it's uh, it's got some Sims vibes to it. Um, the game it is it is uh, described as very similar to all the time is uh, is Prison Architect, but that's because it's it shares the same art style. And then there's another one that I always forget. What's the name of the other one? Caravan is approaching. Let's send. Linux out to talk to him. Or Fallout Shelter. Interesting. Yeah, yeah. I know a little bit about Fallout Shelter. Um, okay. You can buy stuff. You can sell stuff. Another prosthetic leg? I feel like I have to do it. I feel like I have to try and get, uh... Get Sprigate a prosthetic leg. I tried so hard, you know? We're going to try and buy it. We have 700 Plasteel. Shit. Hmm. That's probably enough Plasteel, but... Who needs the leg? Sprigate needs it. Yeah, and we're gonna we're gonna make it happen right now. Right leg has been shot off. We're gonna add a prosthetic leg. Install a prosthetic leg on your right leg. We're gonna do it. Rest until healed. Go there. Now who's our best doctor? It's surprise, right? Surprise. Go do some surgery. I believe in you this time, surprise. I always keep a spare leg around just in case of emergencies. Exactly, exactly. Also, Brack, really quickly, can you go clean that dirt before this surgery actually starts? Yeah, there you go. Installing the prosthetic leg. Go grab the prosthetic leg from out in the wild where it lays and install this shit. And this time, don't fuck it up. Panda, have you played the escapists? It worked! Yes! Well done, surprise. Well done. Let's go. Oh, I said Panda, have you played The Escapist? Um, she was recommending it earlier, so I wasn't sure. But if you've played it, let me know, Doey. I've seen some of my favorite YouTubers play it. Gotcha. It's gotta be, it's gotta be a couple years old, right? I think I watched it a couple years ago. No worries, Doi. No worries. I think I watched it. It might be kind of old, right? Is that the one where they look like boxing dummies? It's like an escape room puzzle thing? Oh, there's an escapist too. They look like this. It's a whole like, you can like find a shiv and stuff, right? You can like make a shiv or something. That's the one, right? You can make a shiv and, and go from there. All I remember is the shiv. Can you tell? <laughs> Rack's having a major break risk. Go eat some jelly. My friend, go eat some jelly. Ours is researching like a maniac. Let's go. Uh, which one do I want to do first? Probably want to do the actual reactor itself. I'll do this one. Shiv, bed dummies, beating up guards, the whole shebang. Yeah. Bulk goods trader. Um, Linux, go chat with the bulk goods trader, please. It looks fun. 
Looks super fun. I could sell them some kibble. I could sell them some cloth. Sell them some muffalo wool. Sell them all that shit. Make a little bit of money. Sell them some bad pants. We're just gonna make money off that one. Deal. Make some money. Yeah, you can like get into the vents and everything. Panda, I had forgotten that this game existed. I probably watched uh I probably watched a couple of hours of it. Zoe says there's so many games I've seen, but never get around to trying. Ironic thing is that I've been out of work for about 18 months and I still tend to play the same five to six games. Oh Doe, I'm sorry you're out of work. I didn't know that. I'm so sorry. Um I hope you're doing okay. Um that is ironic, though, and I feel you. I, I feel the exact same way about the amount of games that I end up playing. Um, this is not my first time playing RimWorld, and there's a million games. Oh, no, it's voluntary? Okay, great, great. Um, there's, There are. There are a million new games I want to try, but there's a... Uh, why... why and I am trying them, but also why why try the new ones when you've got old favorites like Grimworld to try, you know? Kind of voluntary. I decided to stop looking for a new job after moving because of the pandemic. Whereabouts do you live, Domi? I don't remember. Have we talked about this? Don't have to give me any kind of specific answer or any information you don't want, obviously. Or don't want to give, obviously. But, um... State of Washington. Gotcha. Gotcha. One colonist idol? Uh-oh. Is it Affy? It's our new friend, Affy. Affy, we gotta get you a hobby, girl. Gotta get you a hobby. Or what we could do is always just build our walls thicker, you know? Sure, let's do that. Get that guy to work. Get her to work. Inspired trade. Great, Spriggit. Sounds good. Spriggit, do you even have a good social skill? You got a decent one. Mm -mm -mm. All right. I do not remember what what Jade is uh, what Jade is good for in this game. Um, I really don't remember. I should probably, like, sell it all, right? My force says I finished a fraction of my homework. I hope you didn't have homework that was about fractions. Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Oh, I cracked myself up. Doey, what line of work are you in? I just crack myself up. Affy's researching away. Love to see it. You finished a little bit of it. I was a machinist, but before that I worked in retail, mainly video stores. Oh, interesting. I worked a little bit of retail. Just a little bit. And I, I was not meant for it. Cool. I don't know that anybody's meant for it necessarily, but I was really not meant for it. So if we do this, chat, if we do this whole... This whole uh, building all these extra walls. We could even build these a little bit bigger as well. Our defense is here. All just like if we're looking for shit to do kind of deal. Mm 
Oops. The research is getting there. Of course, says biology is not good. What kind of biology are you studying? Like what? Uh, what? What's what's on uh, on the docket for like things to learn? Mm -mm -mm. I know that I'm gonna curse this immediately by saying it. Guys, we haven't had a raid yet. We haven't had a raid in like an hour. It's great. Do you build the outer walls and then that limits your colony size or do they grow automatically? There's actually a lot of different ways to set up kind of how to do an outer. Some people don't even have outer walls. Um, I, oh no. Put those out immediately. Uh, I don't want these people to, oh shit, oh shit. Yo, we said we were gonna open these. This is hilarious. We said we were gonna open these and then and then they caught fire. And that's what happened. Okay, so never mind. Everybody is drafted and goes right here. They caught fire and then uh and then they did it themselves. That's so fucking funny. This is one way to do it. This is certainly one way to do it. I'm going to send half of you guys out here. Nope, nope, that way, and then out. This person's fucked no matter what. Cool guy, go here. Mars, go there. I don't want him to catch on fire, because I want to... I want to actually keep, like, uh... Like... I want to keep... I want to I want to keep them alive and I want to keep the crypto sleep caskets alive because those are really valuable and I don't want to kill them. Uh, are those colony pods? Wait, what happened? So here's the long story short. When we lit, when we chose this place is our place to build, there is this thing called an ancient danger. All right. So now you guys can go get undrafted. Go put that stuff out. You guys are undrafted, undrafted. Undrafted. Um, basically, there's this thing called an ancient danger, which is right here. Basically, a room, in which we had two of them. This is the, the other one. A room inside of which we don't know what's going on. So, uh, we had one there. One right here. This one, somebody actually decided, like, an enemy came and actually broke into it. Inside of that casket, or inside of that room, was these caskets, which just keeps people in crypto sleep forever. Uh, inside of those can either be good guys, bad guys, whatever. It turns out there were five of them. I didn't want to necessarily uh, to necessarily open them right away, but then a fire broke out and and lit one on fire, which made them panic and they all got out. One of them went right here and just died running into my running into my shit. <laughs> uh, the other four are over here and either dead or in pain. I think they're mostly just in pain. Two of them are on fire. So we're going to go try and save them. We're going to try to save these crypto sleep caskets because that's also exactly what we use for the, uh, for the, uh, for the rocket ourselves. Should we capture or rescue? We should probably capture, right? I think we're going to capture. Capture and then capture. All right. What are they? Are they ancient people? So yeah, one of them was called an ancient warrior. Let's let's see. This one was called an ancient. Uh, the faction is the ancients. So basically, it's like the people who were here before any of the current factions on this on this planet. Uh, yeah. It's an ancient soldier. So yeah. We we don't know what their story is, but a long, long time ago, they uh, they fell, they they went to sleep in these caskets. That's kind of neat. It's so fucking cool. It's always a risk too if you're like, am I gonna go out and try and uh? These guys are probably gonna blow up and die. Like that one's I'm sure dead. Um, these things are about to blow up. I think. Put the fires out if you can. Go get him. Yeah. Oh shit. That one's dead. All right. Well.
We got some decent, uh, some decent stuff out of it, though. Hmm. Not really decent stuff. Sure. Sure. Relations with ancients have broken down completely. They're now hostile to you. Oh, because we captured them. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Also, we have to we have to try and save these people. Death in three hours. Death in 14 hours. Uh, surprise, what are you doing? Please try to tend to this person. So these we actually want to claim and then de and then move to our own. Um, can we move these? No. Technically, they did that themselves. If they just stayed in the pods, I had to come over and put the fires out. Indeed. Let's murder them all by accident. Whoa. whoa, whoa. Murder them? By accident? Kind of a funny idea. Murder them by, ask by accident. <laughs> Ancient dangers are all like... It's all... It's all nervous... Uh, can you rebuild these? I really want to rebuild this. I can't? I just have to deconstruct them? Shit. Oh, I bet I can once I, once I, okay. We're going to keep them there. I think I can probably do it once I, uh, once I research it. All right. There we go. I hope my terrible jokes are slowly lifting Ryan's mood. Panda, seeing your name in chat is lifting my mood. And also the jokes. When in danger, scream and shout, wave your arms and run about. What's that from, Doey? What's that from? Guys, we might have some new, uh, some new colonists very soon. Resistance is futile. Join our cult. We're not a cult. Mostly. Partially. We're sort of a cult. We're a little bit a cult. <clears throat> it was kind of a stranger danger jingle for kids. Stranger danger jingle. It was like a uh, stop, drop, and roll, except for when you're in danger. I want to scream and shout and to let it all out. All right. We're going to make these bitches join our colony, whether they want to or not. Listen, you're joining our colony. You're doing it. They put it to a song so that kids would remember it. Kind of like uh, Stop, Don't Touch Me There. These are my no-no squares. <laughs> Stop. Don't touch me there. These are my no-no squares. Where else would they go? I mean, they, they could try and break out, but fuck that noise. No way. <clears throat> fuck that noise. I feel honestly like right now we have the colonists we need to do this. Things have aligned themselves in the right way so that we're finally back to the point of... Linux, you're supposed to be cooking, right? Linux, what's going on, man? Oh, you're also wardening. Okay. Well, that's fair. Um, but no likes to likes to cook. We'll move footnotes uh, footnotes cooking thing up. Maybe he'll cook a little bit more. 
What is the ultimate goal for the colony? To build a ship and get off world? So there's two ways to, uh, oh no. Footnote has become, he's broken inside and become obsessed with corpses. She's going to go dig up a corpse and present it for all to see. This happened because of, of poor mood. You're digging up, uh, uh, White's, um, uh, uh, Tender's, uh, Tender's body. That's not good. So, uh, there's two ways to win the game. To, to quote unquote win the game. And uh, you'll never do hauling. Hear me out here. Who's getting a good mood? Brack? Bury this bitch. Uh, there's two ways to win the game. You can either build your own rocket, and then the big thing is you have to, you have to uh, defend against other people coming to try and take your rocket to also get off the planet for like 15 days. You have to do all this research and build a rocket, or you can actually travel all the way across the world. This blue home icon is where we are. There's a there's a uh, this this purple flag icon right here. There's a rocket over there that we could go and take if we really wanted to to get off the planet. I've never done that before. Um, I the game to me has always kind of felt like a little incomplete in terms of the world thing. To me, it's always been like you basically have your colony, and there's some stuff you can do out here in the world. You can make like uh like caravans to other places to do some trading but you can't do more than one colony at a time you can only do the one the, the one colony so that part's always felt a little bit to me i like to have one colony to to make my own ship and to get out of there from there um yeah Uh, yeah. It's not Meg this time. It's not Meg this time. Footnote's like, oh my god, we're all gonna die. Mwah ha 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 ha. Indeed. Pulling a corpse out. Yep. It's challenging. It's, there's, the, if we make it off of this, uh, off of this world, it'll actually be, I think the first time I've ever successfully made it off of the world after hitting very rock bottom. So rock bottom in this game, if, if all of your people die, which can happen and happens all the time, the first time that happens, the first time every single person in your colonist in your colony is either dead or like, you know, knocked out, not able to move. What happens is they send you a man in black and the man in black is like the savior. Um, and we had a man in black. His name was Mikhail, the entrepreneur. And uh, he showed up. But then, somehow, we got one more person back alive, and we still made it out. Shit, it's a raid. Uh, they're going to prepare for a little bit. Oh my god, there's fucking ten of them. Duck's going to head out. Good luck with the rocket or the massive failure that is about to happen. Thanks so much, Duck. It was great to see you. Have a great rest of your day. Congrats on your big news. Um, Alright, so we have a raid, but they're going to take their time, so that's fine. As long as our shit is rebuilt, which it appears to be. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, do we all have good guns? We all got decent guns, it seems like. An EMP launcher, incendiary launcher. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. I think we. I think we're ready. That gang is being led by Cartman. Did it say that? There's so many names. There's Happy. There's there's Giggles, Kaori, Spider, Sass, Tamara, L Lyle, Oleg, Ida, Happy, Sand, Reichgard, Paulette, Cass. Oh my god. You killed Kenny. Oh, the guy with the red shirt. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Oh. Okay, so we actually might have a problem here. There's like 40 of them. How many are there? 40, quote unquote. There's 21. Shit. That's too many. That's way too many. The bad joke. Sorry. No, it's not. Don't apologize. No, we don't apologize. I'm thankful that you're here. I, uh, there's no, no, no reason to apologize at all. Uh, okay. So... The cooking is not going well, by the way. We should really make Mars. Hmm. Yeah. 
Any second now, they're going to attack. I would be lying if I didn't say that I was a little nervous. All right. Everybody gets drafted. Go right here. I hope that some of them actually go to the side. It appears that some of them will. Cool guy is the one who cannot shoot. Afi's a great shot. Cool guy can't shoot. So cool guy is going to go pick up a, uh, a shield thing. Where is it? Cool guy, go force equip that. Right now they're just sort of milling about threateningly. It's true, they are. It's true. Just kind of chilling. Uh, threateningly. <laughs> In a very threatening way. Mars is also going to go hide in his normal spot. That looks like that's going to go north. If that is true, we'll put Affy up there. All right, spread out, motherfuckers. It's Affy versus a bunch of them up north. Nope, they're all going to come this way. All right, they're all going to come this way. Affy, come back down. Mars is the pacifist. Mars and Cool Guy both refuse to do uh, to do dan to do anything. They are incapable of violence, quote unquote. Gonna try and break through the door. Oh shit! There's something in the way. No, that's not good. That means all of these are not gonna work. We're lighting them up though. We are lighting them up. Bulk goods trader is approaching. That's actually great. What direction? Go help me fight these bitches. Come on. All right. Yo, we're laying them out. F4 says I finished my math. Finally. I'm proud of you. Yo, these guys are fucked. Honestly, not that bad at all. Not bad at all. Are any of them alive at all? None of those guys. Not them. Not them. No. 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 Not that one either. All right. Well, you're all undrafted. That was fun. That was easy. That was easy. Mars has been here from the start. Mars and Maddie are two original colonists. Can you believe that? Two of the original three. Meg just woke up from her nap. How you doing? Sleepy. He's sleepy. They're OGs. It's true. Very sleepy. I'm very sweepy. I'm very sweepy. All right. Uh, sell some chocolate to him. Oh my god! Take all my insect meat, please. I don't want it. I don't want it. Meg has been resurrected IRL. IRL. She's been resurrected. Sell him the beer. Can I sell him all of the shit that I just uh, that I just just got from killing all of those people? No. Okay, sorry, one second. I'm taking a look at stuff I might want to buy. Not really much, frankly. I could sell some uh, some chocolate. Sure. Great. Thanks for the info on this game. I think I might check it out. I think it's still free on Game Pass, and I have Ultimate. Dude, you should. Yeah, yeah. The game is 100% worth checking out. Um... 
a lot of different ways to play it too. You can go really gentle at the start, which is uh, which is a great choice because it gives you uh, lots of leeway. <laughs> and then you can go just like really, really difficult starts. Um, like the ones where you're just one player with almost nothing or the ones where you're like seven or five players with a lot more, all kinds of options. Thrombos, that's great. Of course, Doey. Thanks for being here. Ooh, that sounds fun. Yeah. Have fun. It was great to see you. Oh, shit. Are these guys mad now? No? Just slightly injured? They broke all my shit. See you, Doey. All right, chat. We have about an hour left. Let's see how far we can get in the next hour. It's about how far we can get in the next hour. I've never heard of that. Mods that give you alternate starts to, to some of the more popular games. Like like uh, some of the games like Fallout 4 or Skyrim. Alternate starts, huh? See you, F4. Have a great rest of your day. Much love, man. See ya. So this is going to be where we put our rocket, by the way. Right here is where the rocket goes. Mad buck. Hear me out, though. What if we just killed it? There we go. Now it's dead. <laughs> Hear me out. What if we just... What? Electric and Brack are fighting? What are you fighting for? What are you fighting over? Brack has an ambrosia, to ambrosia tolerance? Dude, Brack's always getting addicted to drugs in-game. Damn it, man. Is the food situation any better? Why is the food situation not any better? Uh-oh. Food situation is not better. Um, Mars, you just became a, no a number one cook again. It's because Linux is wardening so hard. Plus, as for Skyrim, it's a mod that skips the opening section and lets you choose several scenarios where you spawn somewhere else. Interesting. Hi, Mars. How's it going? Welcome. You're still alive. You're stressed currently. And recreation starved and hungry, but how's it going? Guys, how close are we to having new characters? 19, 2, 13, and 1.3. So really close on two of them. Thanks so much for watching this episode of our RimWorld playthrough. If you liked what you saw, I would really appreciate a like on the video. Otherwise, we will see you tomorrow, same time, same place, for more RimWorld.